Yo, what's up everybody? It's the Legend of W here and I'm playing the Call of Duty Black Ops 3 multiplayer beta. Yes, I'm fucking excited to play this game everybody. So, um yeah, as you can see on the screen right now, I'm just showing like a little quick uh footage of me just customizing one of the uh some machine guns. I I believe this is the CUDA. Uh but in this video, I really wanted to show you guys uh the Man of War, which is uh I believe the second assault rifle you get in this game if you uh use your tokens and i gotta say that this is practically I, I believe this is the best assault rifle in the game in my opinion even though i haven't experienced the other uh weapons yet i really have to say for beginners i believe the man of war is a really really good weapon and you're gonna see it in this gameplay so i'm just over here just you know trying to contest with this guy and i managed to knock him out with a couple shots i got killed right there <laughs> Because I wasn't really focused. Um, so yeah, the the Man of War is just a beast. It it um, has a little bit low rate of fire, but it's actually well balanced because the damage and uh, I believe the accuracy is just really really high. Like it, it, it's an absolute beast to use, and it just kills everybody. So like in this footage here, I'm just like knocking people down. Like boom, you're going down. Boom, got a quad feed. Shit was crazy. So yeah, eventually I got killed here because I didn't think that they would just spawn there. But yeah, that it happens. So anyways, I'm using one of uh, the unique specialists. Uh, I forgot uh, this specialist name already. I'm sorry. I'll just, you know, write it down for you guys uh, when I double check. Uh, but basically, she's the uh, hooded um, specialist who uh, has the ability to uh, shoot arrows. And uh, also, she has the ability, uh, as you saw a little bit earlier, I was able to um, call out like some kind of uh, like radar where I'm able to uh, see through walls and see where the enemy is located if I activate it nearby them. So that's actually really useful uh, in the beginning, in my opinion. You know, if you're having a hard time figuring out where the enemy is and you know you get your specialist up uh to max then you can activate it and you know temporarily see where the enemy might be so um yeah th this is one of the uh three maps in uh black ops 3 that you're able to play right now um this is actually i would say this is my second favorite map uh it, it's actually pretty cool they got some nice you know closed um closed hallways and it's just tight like in the middle it's it's pretty tight um outside of course you know you have a little bit more open space so um you have to be careful when you get attacked and of course right here as you can see i'm using uh my specialist move and yeah i failed to catch that guy i didn't even know why i tried to knock him out i knew i was gonna die but i said fuck it i'm gonna die anyway right so as you can see when i turn red that means that i'm being tracked down uh, by the same uh, specialist that I chose. So um, when you see red, that means that you're being tracked and they can see you through walls. So um, it's temporary. So all you have to do is just make sure that you don't get killed, basically. Um, so yeah, uh, some impressions, like first impressions about the game. Uh, what I really like is that um, it, it's uh, a lot faster. Uh, actually, a lot faster than um, Black Ops 2. Surprisingly, I, I really thought that Black Ops 2 was really, really fast, but this game uh, kind of proves me wrong. The, this game is definitely much faster than Black Ops 3. Uh, and I also noticed that so far, I mean, things might change since this is a beta, but uh, some of the guns are actually really, really powerful. Like the Man of War, like I just mentioned, is a really powerful assault rifle. Um, I do notice that uh, the shotguns are actually pretty weak in my opinion they're really really weak i would expect um shotguns to be like consistent one hit killers but they're not i actually feel like the man of war is a one hit killer at times even though it isn't um but yeah like uh i think uh, the shotguns could use like a little bit of a buff you know to to compete uh maybe i'm just using it wrong i don't know uh so yeah i'm catching a couple kills over here you know just doing my thing it, it, i was having a little hard time trying to figure out where the enemies were um 
during the middle of the match because I don't know. I guess these guys were just running around. I was just running around the wrong places at the wrong time. So uh, I was trying to look for them and stuff. Yeah, and of course, there's some conversations in the background since uh, I completely forgot to uh, <laughs> mute everybody. There's actually a pretty cool feature where you can um, mute everybody by default um, in the options. So you can just mute them and you don't have to worry about muting anybody ever again if, you know, you're annoyed by people talking on the mic or, you know, just random, you know, noises in the background. Sometimes people just leave their mics on for some strange reason. And yeah, like like a real smart guy, I somehow just tripped <laughs> all the way down uh, to my death, which was hilarious. I actually cracked up when I saw that. I was like, I can't believe I actually died. Over here, I tried to like get this guy and boom, like he was just hiding. He didn't really want to like fight, fight, like rush. Because I noticed some people like really like to fight and they really go hard at it. And I was just like, ooh. Now, a few problems with uh, the beta that I experienced so far is uh, some server issues. I noticed that uh, I, I received an image. I, I don't have it on me in this video, but I did notice uh, a message that uh, stated that, you know, uh, there was like some kind of queue. And I, I thought that was the weirdest thing when uh, I was playing this game. Like, I was like a, a, a server queue and, and it stated like about like five hours. I was like, oh my God, how how am I, um, you know, going to wait for five hours just to get into the game, which was a little bit weird. But then, you know, I thought to myself, let, let me just try to uh, restart the game. And then once I did that, I managed to uh, get in the game just fine. And um, so I, I believe it's just some kind of, um, I guess, some kind of glitch or an error that uh, the servers are having right now. I have no clue. I know I definitely know that a lot of people are trying to get into this game. Oh wait, hold on. Here goes the quad kill. Boom! Oh yeah. Really, really fucking dope. Love that. And um so yeah, I, I believe a lot of people are having a hard time um getting into the game. Um oh a little quick tip for those who um are getting errors um for not being able to install the beta you have to make sure that you have uh your uh what is it you have to have your ps4 updated uh at the latest update so i believe it's 2.57 i don't remember right now but just make sure to update your ps4 and then you'll be able to play the game uh just fine so uh just be patient everybody if you can't get into a game um you know just try to log in it's a beta so there's gonna be a lot of uh, tweaks that need to be worked out so yeah oh man and i died i was like damn man let me try to get at least one more kill for this i couldn't even break uh i believe i couldn't even break 40 uh kills in this match but anyways it's 75 42 cdp1 which is my team we beat the black ops team and oh look at that last kill right there damn look at that is it gonna get like one shot boom yeah that's a mean shotgun right there um so yeah, like uh, I, I I really like uh, what I'm seeing so far from Black Ops Three. Definitely, uh, I feel is much better than uh, I believe it's the past uh, two Call of Duty titles. But that's just my opinion. Uh, I believe Treyarch got something uh, pretty good right now. Uh, as you can see, my final score was 38, uh, 10. So that wasn't really too bad. I thought I was gonna hit 40. Uh, but yeah, that didn't occur. So yeah, of course, um, there goes my stats right there. I uh, managed to get 38 kills, 10 deaths. Uh, I leveled up to 9 uh, in this session. So yeah, um, that's pretty much it, everybody. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Look at all those medals that I got, man. Shit. That was a really good game that I had. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, if you did, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe for more. I'll be posting more uh, Call of Duty Black Ops 3 gameplays uh, for pretty much the duration of the PS4. So stay tuned for more. Thank you so much once again for watching, everybody. I'm going to see you guys in the next chapter. Peace.